I mean, really serious people. The suitcase full of snacks. That's the product. Do you have the money? <laughs> Hello, guys. Uh, it's been a minute since I've vlogged. I hope the light is okay. I feel like the kitchen usually the light is like here or there. Uh, where are we going? To make Rainy some lunch. <laughs> this other uh, account I've been watching, or I've watched a couple of times on Instagram. I'll insert like a clip over here. <laughs> so funny uh, anyway I am making some lunch for Rini we're doing matoke uh, I'm gonna mix it with some potatoes and then some beans uh, to go with it and then the plan for today is we need to go to the supermarket to buy a few things tomorrow we are going to see Ian's mom which I'm so excited about um, this time around we we because now we have rainy the last time we, it was just black and black so we we actually rode the economy but this time i feel like it's because it's plus rainy and the economy seats in the chain are usually so tight like tiny <laughs> and then I asked my dad, like, how did you... Because he went to Mombasa on the first class. I was like, so how was it? Was it nice? Was it more spacious? Because I was actually thinking about uh, booking that one. Who is my dad? My dad is like, it's the same thing. The only difference... <laughs> the only difference is that the table is, is, like, retractable. So, anyway, but I hope... It's gonna give us more space, especially because of rain. Um, yeah, so we need to do some a few things. I've already bought most of the things that I need to buy. We're not really going with uh, much shopping this time. I prefer because now we're traveling with with three kids. I prefer to just maybe do the few that we can't get there, and then maybe when we get there, then we shop for whatever we need to shop for. So, not to see the ban sana. So from Nairobi, she said she wanted some ground nuts and some uh, uji, the one for cherubet. You know, I don't know if you guys have seen it um, in the supermarket. I think it's Teremba's mom, if I'm not wrong, who it's her company or maybe she, I don't know. But it's a really, really good uh, brand of uji. It's called cherubet uji. Uh, it's fermented. It's nice. It's sweet. Like, I don't know. I just love fermented uji. And then Ian was dissing me the other time. <laughs> because when I was breastfeeding, I think for the first six months, there was a lady um, who used to make for me uh, fermented uji. Guys, it was so delicious. But then it makes your it makes your breath almost smell like uh, like it's like it has a, like an alcohol smell, like a fermented. I don't know how I can explain it. But if you've had a fermented uji, you know. But me, I love it. It's so delicious that fermented uji. What? Anyway, so we need to get that. Uh, we need to get what else? We need to get some snacks for the babies because also on our last train ride, I really didn't. I found that the food was just normal. It wasn't really food; it was just snacks. So this time, I want to carry food, food, and then I remember the last time also we had to leave deodorant. So I'm like, I don't know, will they? Will they ask us to leave the deodorant and the perfumes again? Because I'm like, man, I want to smell good and void, man. You know, that place is hot. <sighs> so I don't know. We'll see about that. But we want to make sure we do everything early. Thank God for Ian. He's really been helping me around the house since our help left. Um, yeah. So let me finish over here. They've gone to get some milk for Rainy. And then now we go to the supermarket. 
get a few things come back and pack oh guys i don't know if i showed you guys no i didn't show you guys let me let me show you guys real quick um some of the suitcases that we, we got i had asked on my instagram if you guys could recommend a few places uh because the 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 bags that we had the handles zilikuwa zimesha bunjika or zimekatika rather so uh let me show you then the straps if you guys know where i can be able to get the straps because the bag is really nice it's really sturdy it's just that the straps are zimetokana so this is the one that we got we, it's a set of three so all of these came inside this one the material it's not like super super heavy you see but it had really good reviews so oh and then some shoes for mom it had some really good reviews so i decided let me get it and then for the price point it was okay for the three they were nine thousand five hundred um the, del the delivery was free i am not going to tag the page yet let me just use use them and then if i like them then perhaps um i can tag them what i really love about it which i wish my makeup suitcase had is like these wheels like these wheels literally like they go around and around and around and around like i really really love that like you know just and i know it's <laughs> it's something that is so normal but to me i am so just by it because most of my suitcases don't have these rotating wheels and then also the company said it's a one year uh, warranty on the handle and the wheels so we'll test it out tomorrow i really don't want to go with all three of them i'd like to go with maybe just like maybe two but i don't know because maybe ian and my clothes here the twins and maybe rainy but then i feel like this is also kubebana sana i don't know we'll see we'll see how it goes but yeah so at least i'm excited about uh that which reminds me which reminds me i need to wash my brushes before we go because um i have a client right after when we come back so i don't want to come and then start washing brushes on that day so at least that would have given it enough time to dry you know yeah so let me finish up with rainy's food and then to tongea huko mbele yes hey, people are back from from getting new milk by the way guys man and i can't put a track over here hey. trying to see mamisha a phone without a trapper turn wow just <sighs> anyway uh a little update by the way before i continue you remember i think i think i said it you remember when i had to touch myself at oh he his food needs to have flavor blah 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 i i think the literally the next two days the two days after we just went back to boiling food yep and ali Ali shikarada so that's what we, are, we usually do so just boiled food and he likes it but more and more nowadays he he tastes some of our food so he's starting to appreciate um adult food flavors and I, i'm thinking very soon because now he's almost two years i'm thinking i think i should even start him up on just our own food but it's just that sometimes when i try to give him my food anakata and i'm like where i really need to shukarada I really need to just see how I can be able to incorporate food because we don't put as spices in our food. It's usually like just very nice but um uh basic flavors for lack of a better word. And yeah. So a little update on that. We went back to boiling food. We are at the supermarket and somebody has already slept. Oi. Maybe we need to put a sweater for him shopping for some things the small ones the tattoo shakweli it's for we don't need to have so much oh you don't need so much okay and then today guys the supermarket was so full we were only able to get these small ones so we've gotten some yogurt some crisps uh juices water yogurts over there and we're going to go and get crisps on the other side if you know the aisle for Carrefour where it's near the counter that's usually the sweetest tasting crisps so we get that and then we go so these ones yes so we're going to get some potato and then just the one the chili ones some of the snacks we are not having because who is sugar rush
So we are in the middle of packing. Let me tell you the number of clothes that we have had to carry for Rainy. He literally we've had to put um his own suitcase. Because you know you have to carry so many clothes to change babies and a hundred million diapers. <laughs> I feel like it it feels like we're moving to your mom's. <laughs> Look at all these clothes. And we still haven't arranged ours. Four yeah, so this one is the one that is left. Um, so this one is going to be for me and for Ian. Babies have already packed. So rainies are here. And then on this other side, we're going to put snacks. So this one, we're going to cover it and zip it up. And then here we put snacks. Because this is the smallest one and it can be easily accessible. So this is the stash. Yeni, you have to be serious with snacks when you have children, okay? <laughs> we have a whole suitcase just for snacks. Very <laughs> <Are you> serious. <laughs> you gotta be serious, man. Previously on how to smuggle snacks. But the the train doesn't really have like dope snacks, and then they are quite expensive. The last time, like one muffin was 100 and it's the small one. So, like, wait. Hey guys, uh, it's 6 o'clock. We need to be out. I was trying to feed Jamie. Who am I? Hmm? I'm a for Chakula. So, I just breastfed him. I want to shower right now. Our Uber is already out. And we get out of here. We'll catch our train. So, let's go. Please, yes, that is it. And then it's like, oh. <laughs> I'm really serious people with a suitcase full of snacks. There's the product. Do you have the money? Hey, lady, my. Told you I will come. <laughs> you want to know where we are? We are. <laughs> Okay, say when you're watching in the background, but we are Finally, it's so hot and humid and beautiful. I feel like this is the kind of climate that I was born for, if you know what I mean. Merry Christmas, guys. Merry Christmas. Oh my goodness. I am ready for this heat. If there's one thing I carried, it is sunscreen, okay? We are ready for this heat. Nairobi, <sighs> goodbye. Goodbye to you, my trusted friend. We've known each other since we were nine or ten. Together we've climbed hills and trees. <laughs> Hi guys, sorry for the lighting. We have been here since I think midday. It's now around 7, 8. Guys, let me tell you, I don't know if you can see the stars. Let me show you guys, like, this place is so beautiful. The stars, you can see them so clearly. The moon. If vibes was a place, it would be this place. Honestly, honestly. Look at that, man. Look at that. Do you guys see Mars? Twinkling, twinkling red. 
and he rained. <laughs> and also on this side, I don't know where the moon has gone to. It's so beautiful. What's with the drum? Huh? What's with the drum? What is it? So this is the first meal that Jenny has eaten since yesterday. Okay, not really the first meal. He's had Vitamix earlier on. Apparently the guy just wanted some good tasty food. Because when you boil for him, he is, he's like, just spits it out. But when now he eats, because now this is the same food as yesterday, Gioni, but we put some chicken soup, so now it's tastier. So now the boy is eating. Do you think it's time we just start eating? We start eating our own food. Yes. Yeah. Guys, at what? At, at how many months or how many years did you guys start stop having special food for your babies and them just eating the same food as you guys? Because he yaku chemsha, imeanza kugonga lipo. And then look at how he's sweating. <laughs> Yeah. Pasta. Pasta. Mm. Yeah. 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 Pasta. The salmon is hot. And anywhere that there is water, and at a footer, and then he's a mikono. Just so he can cool himself down. This is, he's on his how many bottle of water? Um, I think fifth. Fifth of, for the day. Yeah. Ladies are doing most of you guys with drinking water. <laughs> But even me, I'm not. I've not drunk as much water as I should. By the way, as you should. As I should. But this is this place is nice. And cheers. You've got the chicken foot. I've asked Mama. Mama, would you like to taste the chicken feet? Then she looked at it. She was like, but it has claws. <laughs> Comfortably say I am now an experienced chicken leg eater. Baba, let's just do six more spoons. Six again. Just six more spoons. If we, if we do just six more spoons, you can go about your business. Just six, like and nice ones. You open your mouth. And you okay, and then you can go. No, Jamie, have yeah, that's six spoons in the jar. Even eaten, I've not seen a bit. A bit, okay. So, so let's finish this food, and then today we're cooking chapati. Who is cooking chapati? I am. It's near the ring, it's near the streets. Chef, chef, call me Michelle. Chef, Michelle, stop it. <laughs> Hey, good job, good job. Mafula. Go on, yeah. Maybe we will have a the Ungu. Down. 
Chamtem. You love it? You love it? Good job. Yes. Good job. Hi guys, um, catch up after a long <laughs> couple of days. I've not really been filming much. We've just been, you know, doing, you know, just kosha vyombo, kosha nguo, just the normal chores. But it's been really like nice and fulfilling. And then just the vibe. Do you guys see this place? See this other side, it's hills. And then we're going to say hi to Ian's mom. Tell me why we are going with a whole suitcase because it has snacks. About us, we are serious about snacks. When you have kids, you gotta be serious about snacks because when you go outside, okay, you go outside and you don't have snacks, what you gonna do? Hmm? How you going to entertain the kids? Hmm? What you gonna do with yourself? <laughs> 